Hey guys, got another video here for you. This is a quick basic video on how to remove the Windows installer unused files on a Windows 7 system. Now it could be Windows XP or Windows Vista as well, but this is a Windows 7 64-bit machine. Now part of your, part of your maintenance um, routines that you may be doing for customers or yourself, uh, junk files get put onto a system all the time and after a course of uh, time it will start to build up. And if you want to remove these files, you can use handy little programs like CCleaner and, and other tools like that. Now if you're a bit um, scared about rooting around the system in case you delete the wrong files, then using little tools like these are very useful for beginners. Now as you can see, you've got Windows installer un unused files cleanup tool here. This is done by kztext.com. This guy makes some serious uh, bits of software that are very useful. and. Um, there is a couple of other tools that he does as well, which I, you've probably seen some of my videos on. So let's have a look at the uh, program itself. When you run it, it's pretty basic and straightforward. All you need to do is click Run and then Scan, and it will find a load of files that aren't being used anymore by Windows that you can actually remove. And as you can see, it's scanning and finding quite a few. Now this is in the Windows installer location, as you can see here. And I'll show you that location now in the C drive then come down to Windows and then as you can see it's not there and the reason for that is because it's a hidden file so you need to go to Organize, Folder and Search Options View and then take the tick out of the Hide Protected Operating System files say yes to this click OK and you should see that folder now appear and there it is there ok so it's finding files inside here that it wants to remove. Now if you're a bit scared about removing stuff then using tools like this are pretty uh, good for beginners and I would uh, strongly suggest that you use these types of uh, tools until you understand a little bit how things work and what's junk and what ain't junk. Okay, So all you need to do here now is put the ticks in the stuff that you want to remove and there's quite a lot of it and then you put the ticks in and then click on delete and it will remove those files for you okay now you don't have to remove them they won't do any harm to the system but part of the um, maintenance routines that you may be doing for customers you may want to clean up the system all the old junk okay hope you enjoyed it my name is Brian from brightech.co.uk if you enjoy these videos please remember guys hit that subscribe button show support and also rate and favorite all my videos if you enjoy them and if you've got any other requests for videos Drop me a message and I'll do my best to make that video for you. Okay, thanks again for watching guys. Bye for now.